Hi everyone, uh, welcome along to this week's cooking vlog. Today we're going to make a uh, chicken and noodle bake. So, I shall show you what you will need. Okay, so we're going to need some chicken breast, some peppers of your choice. I've got some sweet red ones and just your normal yellow and orange ones. I find the green ones bitter so I never, I never use those really. Some courgettes, some carrots, onion, some parmesan, uh, fresh cream and the, the dried noodles that you get in a packet like that. The really fine ones. Fine egg noodles are called. Did I say chicken breast? Can't remember. And some of those chicken stock pots. And last but not least, some garlic. Right, let's crack on. So the first thing to do is to cut up your chicken breast and fry it off with your garlic. So, chicken breast, just into nice Do sort of like thin strips if you like. Hopefully you can see. Yeah, that might be better. Just some thin strips like that. Okie dokie. So that's the chicken chopped up. A uh, bit of oil in my pan. Just let that heat up for a second. And then the chicken will go in. Just whilst the chicken's cooking away, I'll uh, get the garlic all crushed up and ready to go in. Okay. Right, so garlic done. Go in. What I shall do now. Get my other walk out. And I'll prepare the peppers and the veg whilst that chicken's cooking. The same with the peppers, just thin, thin strips again. With the courgette, what I'm going to do, top and tail it, and chop it into three. I'm just going to do really thin slices like that. Thank you. 
Right, I've, um, I've turned the chicken off because that's done. Uh, I've just got the onion. I'm just going to put half an onion in this, I think. That'll just be into half onion rings. Carrots are going to do the same way as the um, the courgette, so really. Top of the tail. One to three. And some nice thin slices. Right, so there's my veg all prepped up. I've just put them in a bowl because my uh, chopping board had run out of space. Right, so, hold back on. And then, put some olive oil in your pan. Just let that warm through for a second. Uh, and then we're just going to fry these off just the same as we did with the chicken for a little while, just till they start to soften up a little bit. That's Archie in the background, he's uh, eating a banana and, and singing. Singing for your tea, aren't you? Get the bacon tray ready. Right. Your noodles out of the packet, straight into your dish. Just snap them up so they all fit. This one dish, is, it won't be enough for us all, so I'll just show you the one. I will actually be making more than this. So we, uh, Yes, Archie, you tell them. So we all get something. So. <coughs> uh, in this pan I've probably got uh, three quarters of a pint of water, I would have said, something like that. Which I'll add my two chicken stock pots to. And I'll just let those dissolve. So, my pan of chicken. I shall now just add the cream. Straight in. I've got two tubs for this lot because there's quite a few of us to to feed. And then once these, once this chicken stock pot's melted, I'll add that to it as well. Right, that's that. In that goes. That's it. We're pretty much done. So, all we need to do now is turn the veg off. Some veg over the top of your noodles. Okay. 
and then the same with your chicken just all over the top quite a bit of the, the sauce And then I think I'm going to put a bit more of the veggie over the top of that as well. Right. Oops. That's that done. So, there's your almost finished dish. last thing I'm using parmesan you can use whatever cheese you like if you don't like this it's quite strong isn't it you can use um, just your normal cheddar cheese or, or any, anything you like and that is just grated all over okay so that's it that's your, your finished meal all you've got to do now is tin foil over the top And then that's just going into an oven, which I've set at uh, 175 degrees C. For 15 minutes that's going to go in. Right, so that's had its time in the oven. I shall now just get that out. Oh, the smell of that is unreal. <laughs> right, so let's dish some out. For well, as you can hear, Archie's getting a little impatient for his tea. Oh, no, he stopped. No, no, he's gone again. So we shall dish his up first. Come. Leave it too many there for him. That's it, that's little arches. So we'll just cool that down and he can have his tea and then we shall serve everybody else up. And then you, Hallie, that's right. So that's it for this week's cooking vlog. Uh, let me know how you get on. I hope you really enjoy this. It smells really, really nice. And we are now going to all get stuck in and enjoy our tea. Anyway, thanks for watching again and we'll see you next week.